tries to explain to them that that's the case, they say you don't know what you're talking about. Uh, one of the things that I've really noticed is that now, under the current uh, NASA, they don't really, are, they're not really interested at all in talking to people like Steve, who had real experience in the program. They think because of all this new technology and everything, all the experience that is no longer relevant. Now, under Constellation, I insisted, and I was I was able to get a group of Grumman reliability engineers, where you part of it, right, mm -hmm. to go down to Washington and to speak to the designers of the Constellation program elements about their experience on Luna module, and they thought it was invaluable, but that all went away. Uh, Constellation was canceled, and uh, so we're left with what we have now. But I think you're, if many of these questions you'll find really interesting to hear from Griffin, who's really got uh, got these these things under control because he was the NASA administrator and people are talking to him all the, you know, for example, the, the NASA people said, we want to be totally open about the program, we want input and all this, so this situation on the, on the Boeing spacecraft, they have a report already done before they decided to land it unmanned and they have a report being developed right now post-flight. Post and I asked for a copy, they said, no, we decided to keep that close to the vest. Mm -hmm. And you know, that's just wrong, mm -hmm. okay? So, but, okay, that's my opinion, right? But uh, Griffin will talk about that. So I suggest you come and bring your friends because uh, he's a really notable, not just Peter. Okay, <laughs> thank you. Okay, thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. All right, guys, see you on the 15th of October. But you have to sign up. I'll send out the notice, so please respond to it. We had uh, Michael.